<laughs> Chill, I want to ask you, can you, can you talk a little bit about what it means to see a character uh, who uses a wheelchair in the Walking Dead universe? You know, the thing about it is funny, because I always tell people all the time, it's like, living in the real world, you be moving amongst walkers. Yeah. You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah. And it's like, you want try surviving in the real world. So if I can survive amongst real people, I can survive against somebody who can't think, well, they ain't thinking either. Right. So, I mean, a lot of times, you know, what I, I learned that, such, you know, I have to compare my situation to a window because I have to. And I, and I look and I realize that a lot of times we take things for granted. The smallest things, we take it for granted. And I'd be saying that sometimes when a person is not thinking and you're not thinking about certain things, not being mean, not being ignorant to things, you just, it's just not something you think about every day. So that's the whole thing about being in this show. It's like when people always talk about, hey man, how would you survive? I say, well, go back to episode one. Episode one, it was never was, how would I survive? It's how will we survive? Right. You understand? So I don't care who you are, walking, not walking, you alone will not survive. Right. Yeah, absolutely. So that's the thing. I utilize, I utilize everyone, strengths, to survive. Well, I, I, when your name came up, like that, that you were coming, that you were going to be on the show, I, you know, I'd heard rumors and I'd heard talk, and I know it's true. I'm every, cute. Every, I'm very cute. <laughs> <laughs> everyone, everyone I talked to was so excited that you were coming on the show. I'm, I mean, like, and you're just such a force of positivity in the world too. I'm cute. You and you're adorable. <laughs> you're right, absolutely right. adorable.